What's going on everyone? Charlie here. We have a filing that just got approved out of the Options Clearing Corporation. This is SROCC 2022-005. Background on this. As a covered clearing agency, OCC is required to establish policies and procedures reasonably designed to manage its credit exposures and liquidity risk. However, a clearing member default may result in losses or shortfalls that exceed OCC's routine risk management controls. Now, to address such credit losses or liquidity shortfalls, OCC established tools to reestablish a matched book and to allow and allocate uncovered losses following the default of a clearing member. One such tool, which is the partial tear-up, is a process designed to return OCC to a matched book by extinguishing positions that remain open after o OCC has attempted one or more auctions. Now, while when it initially proposed Rule 1111E in 2018, they noted that the tear-up process would be initiated only if OCC determined that potential losses from remaining positions of the defaulting member would exceed OCC's resources. Now, as far as this um, tear-up change, basically, they're proposing to adopt partial tear-up as a recovery tool. OCC proposed a mechanism for reallocating losses for non-defaulting clearing members arising out of partial tear-up. The rule currently provides OCC's board of directors with discretionary authority to levy a special charge against remaining non-defaulting clearing members. So basically, after the commission finding, after carefully considering the proposed rule change, the commission finds that the proposal is consistent with the requirements of the Exchange Act and the regulations applicable to OCC. And the change, basically, they're going to add specifics to claim values. They're going to add the source of the funds that the claim would draw upon. And basically they're adding these details because they would provide clearing members with material information regarding their potential claims and provide greater visibility to clearing members on how open claims from the partial tear up would be honored. So this one got approved and it should be good to go tomorrow, 524. So let's wait and see what happens.